I don't know what to do. It is Apple's the phone, and you're connecting to Alex. This is Alex from Apple. I can see that your Apple account took two different, different locations. It's coming from Virginia, and it's coming from Dayton, Ohio. So, what do I do? Are you talking to I don't understand what you want me to do. Ma'am, right now I want you to correct the problem and I want you to fix the problem. Okay. Okay, what do I do? Do you have a computer? You need to go in the front of the computer so I can help you. Okay. So, do I turn it on first? Yes, ma'am. Turn it on first. Okay. It's going to take a little bit. You can take your time, no problem. Okay. Okay, what do I do now? Is the computer on? Yes, sir. I want you to look at the keyboard. Do you see the CTR and the control button there? Yes, sir. All right. I want you to press, like I want you to ask you, what do you see next to the... CTR and the control button. Uh, I'm so not good with this. I don't want anybody going in my computer. Ma'am, I don't want you to go in your computer, okay? Yeah. I'm trying to help you okay. see the problem. Yeah. So... Can you please go ahead? Yeah, so... If you can see the problem, can you just go ahead and fix it? Yes, ma'am. I can go ahead and I can fix it. That's the reason I'm talking to you. Okay. So, fix it. All right. Then I need to go ahead and check it first. So, I will able to get it fixed for you, okay? Don't worry about it. Still, the problem is fixable. That's the reason I'm talking to you. If the problem is not fixable, we will not talk to you, ma'am. Oh. So, but... Do you know what name it's in? Ma'am, I know each and everything. Yeah. Okay. Let me tell you. Okay. My heart is hurting. My heart is pounding out of my chest. I don't want people to steal my stuff. Why? Ma'am, you don't want that, right? But Gloria, you're not aware about of this thing. They people already took your some identity. Yeah. Okay. And they are trying to take your complete identity to use it for pornographical things. Oh, okay. I can see, Gloria, your account was used in two different locations. The first activity got placed, it took place in Waterford Way. Okay. Waterford Way, West Henrico, uh, Virginia. It's okay. 23233, zip code. Uh huh. Okay. And the other activities are coming from Dayton, Dayton, Ohio. Uh, it was just used for having some pornographical activities. Hmm. Could you please confirm me, is it done by you? Oh. I don't, I don't know. You don't know? No. Why would I do that? The reason behind that, the people, they are trying to use your identity and what's in bonds. Uh-huh. We need to stop them, otherwise you will be the culprit of those pornographical stuff. Oh, so I could go to jail. Definitely, ma'am. If you're making any lawful activity, that will be. Oh. Well, maybe I better call my lawyer. You can call your lawyer. You can call your attorney. You can call your judge. There is no problem. Okay. Rules are rules for everyone. You need to understand that. Okay. And it is some lawful activity that your people already did. We have the access. You know, we can say that. It's a very simple word, ma'am. Like, you know, if you want, like, you can go and you can ask to anyone. There's no, any kind of stuff here at all. Yeah. So. I'm trying to provide, go ahead. So, basically, what you're saying is whatever activity they're doing, we could go to jail for. Definitely, ma'am. Okay. Huh. That's, that's uh, really scary.
Um, um, it is a, it's not a story, first of all. And then I'm personally trying to help you to get you out from this situation so we can help you. Yeah. You can just get to resolve your problems. But, but what, what do you get out of helping me? Ma'am, the people, they are still in your devices. They are still accessing your complete network. Yeah, but what do you get out of helping me? Ma'am, I'm supposed to get out them. I'm supposed to, Today, like, you know. Today, thanks to the Foundation's groundbreaking research, advocacy and care, some people at CF are taking college. I don't understand. Do I, do I pay you, do I pay you to help me? No, ma'am. You do need to pay. You need to take the support and the service. You are an Apple customer, and if you're having any problems, then Apple is helping you to get the results in. I want you to just turn on the computer mm -hmm. in front of it so we can help you out. Okay, but the only problem I have is I'm not an Apple person. So I don't understand why you're saying I'm an Apple. Ma'am, I can see that your name is used to create an Apple ID two days back. <laughs> that ID was created in Waterford Way, West Kendrick, Virginia. <laughs> I just, I'm, I just don't know what to do. No problem, ma'am. Could you please do me a favor? I want you to turn on the computer and go to the internet. I'm giving you a website that you need to open. Mm -hmm. Okay. After I open the website, what happens? Ma'am, I'm connecting your computer to my computer screen so I can check the problem. And, okay. But I don't know you. I don't see how I can open it. I will help you out on it to get you allow, like, you know, to get you aware about all these things. I know. I have a better idea. I'll just call Apple itself and maybe they can help me. Ma'am, we are Apple. Like, you know, right now you're talking to Apple. Yeah. Well, if I'm talking to Apple, then I appreciate you making me aware of it. And I'll just call Apple and then they'll help me further. But I appreciate you calling. All right, ma'am, no problem. If you don't want that, there is no problem, okay? You thank, enjoy. Thank, thank you. you. All right. Bye-bye. The idiot really thought I was going to give him some information. I had to record this. They will go to any extreme to get you to give them the information. Even as far as saying there is photo jack, obscene photos on your computer. And if you get caught, you'll go to jail because it's in your name. He did have my name and my address. But he could be in another country. If you look on any information, you can find my name and address. But this creep did not get anywhere with me. I played dumb. I wanted to let him know I was dumb. Because I wanted to keep him on the phone to see just how far he would go. In the end, I told him, thank you for letting me know I have a problem. But I will call Apple myself. And he found out he didn't get anywhere with me. I just hope and pray that anyone else that gets these phone calls, which I have gotten for today will please ignore this conversation and ignore these people they are dangerous thank you